Okay. Hi. Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. Unless you are new, then hello, my name is Tori. Today I have a really big wig haul for you guys. Today I have seven wigs that I am going to show you guys and also review for you. These wigs were sent to me by Uvimi, which is a online store which sells a lot of kawaii fashion as well as wigs and kind of cosplay looking items. I absolutely love it. I think it's so cute. And when I am not dressed up in all black and white, I do like kawaii fashion. I like pastels. I think they look really nice. In this video, I'm also going to be showing you guys how I put on a wig cap, but if you guys already know how to do that and you don't want to watch it, just go ahead and double tap this side of the screen twice, and you should somehow, by the power of editing, land at that spot if you do it in three, two, one, go! This is what a wig cap looks like. There are two really different types of wig caps. One that is kind of like a tube, and the other one where this side is closed and it's like a proper like hat for your head. For these ones, just because it's a lot easier to put on, you are going to very simply put it on your head like so, pull all your hair out, and then take the thick end and put it on the top of your forehead, and then pull the rest of your hair back into it. Optionally, you can also pin down your wig cap with a bobby pin, so however, I'm not going to do that. After you have your wig cap on, you're going to go ahead and put on your wig. It is pretty simple. You're going to hold your wig with the front of the wig pointing towards you, and then you're going to go ahead and dive into the wig. That's how I put them on. It's really simple. This is their first wig. It is called their European style long curly hair, I believe, or something very close to that. It's listed on their website at $37. Um, I might experience any like squeezing on my head, which is really good. Towards the end, it is a little bit tangled, but that is mainly caused by it being in a package for so long and then it chipping over. So all you have to do to get the tangles out is just lightly brush it. I so far really like this wig. I got this wig for a Danny Phantom cosplay and I will go ahead and insert a photo right here. This wig comes with bangs which are a little bit too long for me so I'm just gonna have to wear them as side bangs for right now. But I think it's so cute. I also really like how it has little curled hairs at the front of it. So you could kind of put back the rest of your hair, then just have these little like curls out in the front, which is adorable. So honestly, I think we're starting off pretty strong in this wig haul because I'm already in love and I can't wait to see what the rest of the wigs look like. And if they're all gonna be this soft, I'm gonna be so happy because this is so nice. I really like this wig. However, I'm gonna go ahead and give it a nine out of 10 just because the ends are a little bit tangled. So let's move on to the next one. I also wanted to show you how the wigs are arriving. The wigs are showing up in packages like this and then once you open the big package there is a little smaller package with the actual wig inside of it oh this is so cute <gasps> how soft oh my god how nice <gasps> this looks like actual like people hair that's crazy let's go ahead and pop this bad boy on my head I am in love with this wig I love this so much it's so cute so to me it looks like pretty real human hair in like a really weird way looking back on all the wigs that I ordered from them I don't actually think I ordered this wig so I don't know what this wig is called on their website if I could find it I'm gonna go ahead and insert a photo right over here with all the information but this was a surprise to me and I love it. I think it's so cute. It kind of makes me want to dye my hair back to like blonde slash gray. However, I, I've already pledged to myself that 2020 is going to be a year without bleach. So we're gonna see if we can make it that far. So this looks like the natural texture of my hair. So I absolutely love it. I love how light the pink is. It looks like, art, like an actual arctic fox like virgin pink once it's like fully washed through and like almost washed out. Oh, it's so cute. It's just so like light and so nice down here. Oh my god, I'm like in love. I'm actually kind of happy that they accidentally sent me this wig because this is absolutely adorable. Out of a 10, I'm gonna go ahead and give this wig a nine and a half just because I wish the bangs were a little bit shorter. This wig is just as soft as the last wig. However, it's I feel like it's thicker than the last wig. I don't know if it's just me, but this one definitely feels like there's a lot more hair going on. I wish this part was maybe a little bit more like blended in. These two sides are just ever so slightly different length so I wish they were you know a little bit more uniform but I still think this wig is pretty cute. I'm gonna go ahead and change into my next one. I hate these things. These things keep getting on me. Sorry. Let me just fix my hair one moment. 
This is the next wig I'm going to be trying on. It's like a really light sky blue and I thought it would look really nice. This is the next wig and it's beautiful. Again, the bags are a little long. This is their Daily Lolita Sky Blue wig and it's listed at $39. I do think this wig could be a little cheaper just because it's very similar to the white wig that I got. I am not a fan of these. These bangs do not agree with how I want to wear them, so. The hair is super soft. It's definitely a lot thinner than the blonde and pink wig that I tried on. However, I think it still provides enough coverage for you to wear. I got this wig mainly because I needed a light blue wig. I don't have currently any light blue wigs, so comment down below any anybody that I should cosplay that has a similar hair color, but this one does feel a little tighter than the other two. So out of a 10, I'm gonna have to go ahead and give this a seven because of the bangs. Um, they need to be a little shorter or part it differently because this is too long and it just looks a little bit weird. Sorry, I, I, I wanna go switch my wig so I can stop looking at this weird like part situation that's going on. I also did get a little bob cut wig that I'm really excited to show you. I got this wig just so then I could do a couple of cosplays with it. This is their orange straight hair wig. I mainly got it so I could cosplay Misty as well as other some other characters that I have in mind. It's listed on their website at $34. I think it's adorable. I do need to make the bangs just an ever so slightly a little shorter, but this is definitely workable with. On the spectrum of the wigs that I got, it's probably not my favorite wig. This wig does not squeeze my head at all. It is very comfortable to wear. I felt like I had to get this next wig just since I like the e-girl aesthetic and I felt like I, I'm not a true e-girl unless I have this wig and I feel like everybody knows which wig I'm talking about and that is this pink one it is the classic long pink hair wig with a little bit of bangs at the top I think this is adorable it is by far the best bangs out of all of these wigs that I've tried on the hair is also came pretty detangled which is very surprising with how thick this is on their website it's listed as their cute cherry blossom pink wig and it's listed at $37 for how long and thick this wig is it's not that uncomfortable to wear the actual like cap of it's not too tight so it's not squeezing my head overall I'm gonna give this wig a 10 out of 10 I do think the bangs could be like a millimeter shorter I only have two more wigs so I'm gonna go ahead and change into the next one Ooh. Oh, I look like a fiery redhead. Oh, this is great. So it's called their orange egg roll fluffy wig. I do not know why it's called their orange egg, egg roll wig. It is a very curly fluffy wig. I absolutely love it. I like my hair very big and very curly. On the little viewfinder, it doesn't look crazy unnatural. The only thing that I'm really noticing is the bangs and how they look just a little bit weird. This wig is listed at $38 and I definitely think out of all them this one's worth like the bang for your buck I don't think the price is that bad if you also use my discount code mainly because I've spent 20 to 30 dollars on wigs off of Amazon before and when I got them they weren't nearly as nice as this one so to spend the extra 10 bucks I definitely think is worth it so I'm gonna go ahead and change it to my last wig this is their last wig and it's called their Lolita curly hair wig I got it in wine red I love this I think it looks so cute I kind of feel like I look like a goth aerial almost in a little little way I have like the classic emo bangs up front followed by all these curly 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 curls and I love it I, I wish I could do my hair like this every day but I don't think I can because I could like barely I can't even curl my hair in the morning it's awful this wig is the most expensive wig from this haul which is $43 however it is my favorite wig from this haul so I'm gonna give it a 10 out of 10 I Ah, it's in my eye. I mainly got this wig because it reminded me of Miss Lovett from Sweeney Todd and I would love to do a cosplay of her in the future and I definitely will now that I have a wig that kind of matches her hair. Those were all the wigs that I have to share with you guys today. I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Also, thank you so much to UVB for sending me all these beautiful wigs. I am so excited to go out and make some cosplays with them and take some really cute photos. If you guys saw any wigs that you liked, I linked 
link them all in the description below in order that I showed you them. Don't forget to use my coupon code, which is yep, it's still Tori, to get 10% off of your order. And that's for anything in the store. It doesn't have to be wigs. It could also be fashion stuff. I hope you guys are having a fantastic day, and I'll see y'all later.